you pass security. So, okay. I, so obviously you had some liquid in a can, or or maybe not even liquid in a can. You had the can with you, which was gonna make security stop you anyway. Right. You know what I'm saying? Look, listen, listen. D'Angelo Russell is about 21, 22 years old. Oh, is he that young? But yeah, I think okay. he's about that. Okay. So, so 9/11. So 9/11 was 17 years ago. So D'Angelo yeah. Russell at that point was a toddler. Yeah. Since 9/11, they've changed rules in the airport. Where now you get to security, you got to take the laptop out of your bag. Mm -hmm. You got to take your shoes off. You got to take the belt off. Um, you can't have water or liquid mm -hmm. past security, and I mean, God forbid anybody try to, you know, take a weapon through there. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I obviously the basics, you yeah, don't yeah. take certain stuff through security here. Mm -hmm. Listen, man, for, for, for y'all cats that's this, that this guy's age, man, 21, 22 years old, man, if, if y'all ain't been flying enough in, in this day and age, man, y'all need to talk to y'all parents. Because, they, I mean, they, there's absolutely no reason how you don't know the rules of getting to the airport, checking through security. Because, look, I don't, want, I don't want no smoke with TSA. I don't um, want smoke with them cats, man. I say, what I say is I could totally believe that um, D'Angelo Russell... Um, was having a good time smoking weed the night before or wherever he was and realized, oh shit, I got this weed in my bag. After like, they after they got knocked out in five yeah, against um, Philly. And was like, oh shit, I got this weed in my bag. Mm -hmm. I need to do something about it. Um, and, and it had to be right there at security. Um, that he yeah. realized it. It, ha it had to be. Oh, because if you're, yeah. Because if you're at the ticket stand, there's trash cans all over the lobby, right before. I mean, you get but if it was some gas, security. if it was some gas, <laughs> niggas ain't this. And I get it, he rich, but if, if it was some motherfucking gas, niggas don't be trying, don't be trying to throw that away. I I I understand, but you don't want smoke with TSA. Well, right? um, and I don't know how and how privy he is to the law. What's the what's the penalty? <laughs> what's the what's the highest penalty? <sighs> Can he pay the, it? Could he could he pay the penalty if he got caught? And if he did get caught and got passed, mm -hmm. he'd have still had the gas. Oh, they would make him dispose of it. First no, 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 no. I mean, if he did get caught, if yeah, he oh, thought he there was a chance where he uh -huh. wouldn't be caught, uh -huh. and basically was in his mind, did he think the risk was worth it? <sighs> Maybe. You know what I'm maybe, saying? Maybe, maybe, maybe he thought that. And, and that's ignorant to think. Yes, it but is. now he knows now he knows, I would hope. Now he knows that's not ignorant to think, but maybe before yep. that wasn't so ignorant to think. Like if I get past this with this we I still got this gas yep. right now. Mm -hmm. I, I could get off the plane, twist up, I'm good. Roll up. I'm good. Or if I get caught, mm -hmm. worst case scenario. They'll, you know, take it, or I, I don't necessarily know what the protocol is. Yeah, and I, and I don't want to know. Um, in, in this climate, I don't want to. I don't want to know because my pockets ain't long like that. You know what I'm saying? Exactly. exactly. Yeah, you I know what I'm saying. Wanna, but his pockets is long. Sure. But so I mean, that, 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 look, look, we, we, we've said it many times. You a celebrity, and even LeBron said it. I'm a celebrity. At the end of the day, I'm still a nigga. Mm. Yeah, but I don't necessarily know if that got nothing to do with being black or not. I think more so. Well, not so much that. It's just that you just don't know. You you just don't know what the consequences could be. I mean, again, we're talking about top flight security here. We're talking about well, you know. I, I, well, it, I haven't been on many airplanes, but I will say that at all. Well, I will say to other people's accounts, all security ain't top flight at the airport. No, I, well, especially during this past lockout. Yeah. TSA was just letting people that's, through. That's all I said. Uh, especially during the lockout. Uh, so the is it possible that he thought he had a connect that was going to get him through, and that connect ain't come through? I, I don't I'm know. I'm not trying to shoot him bail. I think at the end of the day, you, uh, could, you could go find you some good weed somewhere, wherever I, you're going. I don't know. Yeah, he he flew back home to Kentucky. That's where he's from. From where, though? Uh, from LaGuardia. Okay. Airport. Okay. Yeah, which is not, it's not JFK. JFK is the biggest one in the mm -hmm. tri-state area yeah, in New yeah. York. 
Um, LaGuardia is, you know, relatively smaller, but more domestic flights versus international mm -hmm. out of LaGuardia. So, yeah, look, I mean, LaGuardia Airport, you're going to see celebrities coming in and out of there. Right, okay. You're, you're, you're going to okay. see, you know, familiar faces every now and then. Mm. Um, could he, was he going to the Kentucky Derby? Chances are he probably was going to do that. Look, I'll tell you what. <laughs> All I'm saying, look, <laughs> I, I don't like, I, I get, well, I could try to shoot better about what he maybe thought. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, I, I don't like the fact that Stephen A has to come on this first take and use that damn saying again. Mm. Not for like I don't I don't I don't. I, like I, it. I, I thought it was comical. I, I mean no I don't like it because I, I don't know. It's been a while. It's a I don't I, I was tired of it. <laughs> I don't I didn't miss it. Oh. I didn't miss Stephen sure, A saying. Sure. I didn't miss him saying. It, for, it. for me it was, it, it's it, always, it was funny. It's, it was ne funny. it's never about white people, and I'm not saying that Stephen A is saying. Is is singling out white, singling out black people. I'm saying yep. that white people never get caught with weed. So every time Stephen A has to say it, yep. it's about a black person. It's always about I, yeah. Yeah. So I, I I grow tired. It's of. funny because if you go on YouTube, there's like a 12 minute compilation of Stephen A <laughs> saying stay off that. the weed, like in all the different episodes <laughs> of First would, Take. I would never watch of that. talking about <laughs> players, and in about three or four of those clips. He always mentions, you ain't never seen white people get busted for mm -hmm. it. Yeah. There's always black people getting busted for it. Black, 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 black. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Stephen A. I can't. I'm tired. I don't want to. I don't want to.